What's up guys welcome to Apex thanks for tuning in I just want to keep you guys posted about this all new update we have received on the iPhone 14 series especially the iPhone 14 Pro and iPhone 14 Pro Max as you can see the version number here is 16.0.0 and the size is 353.5 MB and this update is very very important because it fixes a major issue which some of the iPhone 14 Pro users are facing as you can see in the change log it says this update provides bug fixes and important security updates for your iPhone including the following. The first fix is for the camera where the camera vibrates and causes blurry photos when shooting with some third-party applications on iPhone 14 Pro and iPhone 14 Pro Max. We have heard this issue it has been making routes on the internet these brand new iPhone 14 Pro and 14 Pro Max are going through a major issue when it comes to camera on the third-party applications. We have even seen some of the youtubers posting some weird noise the camera was making whenever it was turned on on a third-party application. Now that issue has been fixed with this all new update. Now apart from that there are a few other bugs which have been fixed. Let me just quickly read it out for you. Uh, display may appear completely black during device setup. Copy and paste between apps may cause a permission prompt to appear more than expected. Voice over may be unavailable after rebooting. Addresses an issue where touch input was unresponsive on some iPhone 10, iPhone 10R, and iPhone 11 displays after being serviced. So if you own these devices, iPhone 10, 10R, and 11, this update is going to fix the unresponsive touch input after the phones are being serviced. So these are some of the bugs which have been fixed with this all new iOS 16.0.2 and this also brings in the latest security patch for the iPhones. Now I'm going to go ahead and install it and see if there are any other changes on the device and I'll keep you guys posted if I find something new. Now as far as this iPhone 14 Pro Max is concerned this device is fantastic. The battery life seems to be pretty good on this phone. It is lasting more than one and a half days on a normal usage which is fantastic. Now I will be posting some hidden tips and tricks on this particular device device so stay tuned for those videos you're going to see loads of contents on ios one ui and uh, google pixel devices as well on the channel so if you want to know your phone better be sure you subscribe to the channel and smash the like button if you find this video useful that's about it thanks for watching you guys take care and stay safe i will see you in the next one cheers bye bye